Captain Planet, he's a hero. Listen to Toon Jam, he's no zero. Save the greens, eat your greens. <laughs> the episode watching is Greenhouse Planet, Captain Planet. Yeah. Toon Jam. <laughs> Toon Jam. Hello and welcome to Toon Jam. I'm Matt. And I'm J-Man. And today we are talking Captain Planet and the Planeteers. Yes. Had you not already guessed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, so this uh, show ran uh, initially from 1990 to 1992 and a sequel series named The New Adventures of Captain Planet was aired later um, in 93 until 96. So it is a show about um, saving the planet, basically. Mm. Captain Planet is a, an eco warrior, and the culmination of uh, five elements: earth, wind, fire, fire water. water, and heart. Um, <laughs> of which five people from all over the world. It's yeah. got its represented people uh, from all over the world through painful stereotypes. Um, <laughs> But its heart, I think, was in the right place at the time, <laughs> yeah. maybe. Um, and they all have a power, but when they join together, it creates Captain Planet. Yeah. Um, interestingly, after just saying about them being mm. painful stereotypes, uh, apparently the five planeteers were based on real people that one of the showrunners met during the show's pre-production. Really? Yeah. What? Uh, bear in mind, the heart guy from south america yeah uh has a monkey yeah at all times i don't think they really are mm. that based in imagine that imagine like that would be like them meeting me and just having a guy in a suit with a bowler hat that just drank tea all day <laughs> 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 what what <laughs> it's like oh he's based on him because no, he was I, I had, from england i actually met that guy yeah I yeah him, he was yeah. exactly like that yeah that's so what no clue. Why did he meet? Where was he at? Some sort of international mixer that he just <laughs> met? Someone from each nation? <laughs> <laughs> World food. <laughs> yeah. Well, there you go. That's uh, that's a, a basic premise. So um, let's jump in to memories. Memories. Ah, yes. Thank you. Uh, your memories go uh, um, Captain Planet uh, I watched it uh, upon my wall mounted television when I was a young <laughs> boy um, I, uh, I enjoyed the theme I enjoyed uh, the superhero costume I yeah. enjoyed the chrome skin I enjoyed <laughs> yeah, I mean, <laughs> his, his visual appearance yeah it's just he's, that, a, he's a beacon for 80s style he really is in uh, the heart of the 90s well yeah. at the start of the 90s you just I don't know you can't forget that image once you see that it, mullet burned in is it, it that's all that's the basically if you changed his hairdo yeah it would put the show forward about five years <laughs> oh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> that's why they couldn't change it no, they're like, this is too advanced guys they're like we just only like 80s yeah. cartoons we need to stamp this, to this in the early 90s a, an 80s cartoon continued it's just like so weird like just pat shop was it sprayed green <laughs> <laughs> just terrifying oh no that uh, job is captain it's <laughs> uh. gone um but I, I do remember i used to have one of the toys and uh, it was um yeah. it was wheeler which is the fire guy yeah um and what it was was like um his chest had like a, a like a translucent cavity in it where yeah. it was like the logo and then in his back there was like a little trigger and so you you press this down and it was like a flint lighter yeah and so you'd create sparks in his stomach with fire oh, really? it's like oh that's a really yeah, cool that's thing that's well cool but like it's just yeah, like no way you get that now. no that's that seems like that's... a dangerous <laughs> toy to have you know so um, i had uh, i had captain planet did you yeah but he he changed color in different temperatures oh yeah so when he was when he was warm he'd go pink yeah but when he was cold, he'd go blue. So oh, I yeah. used to, I like, I used to stick him out my letterbox, <laughs> but I hold him by his feet, and then wait for like what felt like ten minutes, 
pull him back in, he'd be blue, put my hand on him and he'd go pink. Ah, uh, yes. And that I'm blue, basically, like, oh, no. How cold was it outside? <laughs> it was a cold day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it must have been winter. Yeah, it must have been. It's it like one of my earliest memories yeah. that is doing I that. that. Um, I love the idea of someone walking <laughs> past your house. Just just <laughs> Captain Planet sticking out the letterbox. <laughs> 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 that pretty much is the culmination of my memories of Captain Planet. Yeah. Now, this is a deep show, which yeah. is how oh, you yeah. know toys are a big thing. Mm -hmm. So it's basically just made for toys yeah but with a twist in that it's actually about the environment with a twist in the fact that the toys are made out of plastic and <laughs> uh, plastic is an oil-based medium definitely yeah. yeah yeah so i mean you know swings and roundabouts here <laughs> <laughs> oh right so um we can go into that later let's go let's go, <laughs> let's go through the plot then so um so um so we, we get the the cool intro which introduces all the characters which explains absolutely everything you need to know yeah it? which i like when they do that i like, do yeah yeah they've got the power of this and the power and the power yeah. of heart yeah and uh, and you immediately like the heart one gets locked like, up because yeah, they don't probably yeah. have an intro they're just yeah. kind of tacked onto the but end. you can tell they were trying to like mix it up because they gave people elements that you might not think yeah were there so like heart was the wasn't a girl basically yeah it was it was one of the guys yeah but it was the guy with the monkey. Yeah. <laughs> um, so he's. Um, it starts in. It's like an oil rig. It's like a. It's what? yeah. It's like a. It's, a, um, it's like a factory type. It's like place, a factory yeah. power plant in it. Like yeah. Pumping carbon dioxide Start into down. the atmosphere. Yeah. That's And it's all. We see. Some, it's like the the villain there is like um, some woman with like a. A weird it's white like streak, a, yeah, that hair. covers half a face, yeah. which is Doctor like, Blight, is it? Yeah, yeah, and that's like mangled that half face, which is yeah, it's towards the end, don't you? But um, you've probably seen her before. She's she's concocting some some. Plans. She's also got some like she's working for a Tim Curry AI. Yeah, what is that? What's that all about? <laughs> it's got the most nineties like fit, like some like slick back long hair yeah. and round glasses that are so painfully it's not, it's not like i don't think anyone in the 90s actually looked like that but no. they did in 90s comics yeah yeah and cartoons i don't know if that was i don't know what yeah she looks like, he looks like a slugworth from like the chocolate <laughs> <laughs> just a strange greasy just, yeah, ai right. fellow with his weird um, but yeah her whole plan is to yeah pollute the atmosphere that's, that's her it. goal end goal as yeah. long as it's polluted she knows. doesn't really matter how it's done this is She's got some sort of new high tech rocket fuel and like yeah, she's like trying to put quick that quick burning rocket fuel. Yeah, the, and she's basically working for the for the president. Yeah, who is she's just like his advisor. Obviously, George Bush. Yeah, the, the first George Bush. Yeah, senior. To the yeah. point where he at one point he says, "Oh well, I'm Bush." Just, yeah, <laughs> it's just like <laughs> just ah, in case I you see. didn't know. Yeah, um, um, but the, it's sort of like he's being advised that global warming is not real yeah which uh, straight away i was like yeah. oh that's pretty you know yeah. that's quite cool mm. but then its teeth are dulled when it's actually like the president's being tricked yeah when in reality he, he would full-on know the truth. yeah so you he, the president's not the villain but i suppose you know it's a cartoon yeah. there's only so much bite <laughs> that it can have yeah for a kid's cartoon um but still i was like you know this is impressive message it's you know yeah saying the naysayers are wrong whatever um um so she's trying to set up this plan she, yeah. she does some sort of mock but they're thing. watching it aren't they from yeah. their base and not happy with the situation no they like kwame starts kicking off hard yeah. it's just like he's pretty sure he starts <laughs> just swinging in the air yeah and, and then one just of them's like, like don't they know not, about global warming he can't hear you yeah it's a tv <laughs> <laughs> but i'm sure it's like the the weird uh, Eastern European air quotation marks. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> She's Linker. Like, oh, yeah. Linker. Oh, they cannot hear you. Yeah. And it's just this weird yeah. accent. Yeah. Everyone's got really weird accents. They have, yeah. Because yeah. when you first say Kwame, he almost sounds Indian as well. It's like it dead weird. It's yeah. a strange. What a mix. What a mix. What got. a mix. Yeah. <laughs> um, 
so uh, they're trying basically um, using this extra fuel to like launch a rocket as well or something. Like. Yeah. So basically, they're going to put loads of this stuff in the atmosphere and use this extra fuel, and yeah. it's, it's just going to be terrible for the environment, basically. So they devise a plan. Yeah. Let's we go down. To, let's go and show the president. Yeah. What's going on? What the real deal is. And um, they get there, but their helicopter has to land because the security guards. Yeah of the president who are these weird guys in vibrant pink suits yeah. and strange like you know old stereotypical chinese hats that <laughs> and it's just like who are these guys yeah. i've never seen them in the in the american Armed Forces. <laughs> yeah, don't see them in the back of the white house do you like <laughs> well they're doing it anyway but then it's just basically an excuse to use some of the power it's one of them yeah wind one like yeah Chucks two of them over. Yeah. And their plan to prove that the factory is bad is mm -hmm. to take the president to the top of it just so he can see the smoke coming yeah. out of it. Which I'm pretty sure that he's have... fully aware. Yeah, that there's Because it's not like he can't see yeah. uh, anywhere above his eyebrows. <laughs> I don't know what's going on above him. <laughs> They're so bushy. Yeah. I can only see what's good what's directly in front That's of me it. it's the weight of being president is you can yeah, you can his only head, look his head side parallel to the eyes constantly down it's so heavy <laughs> takes so much effort <laughs> just to look someone in the eyes but yeah um, so that doesn't work surprise no. surprise yeah <laughs> um but then at the same time they're testing mm. out this new rocket fuel yeah and they're too close to the rocket because mm. it's just been set off yeah and like there's no protocol at this place for no. visitors or presidents and they can literally just walk onto yeah. the rocket and in fact they like, do end up just no no pink disc hat <laughs> fellows are gonna stop them no matter what <laughs> they do there's no stopping them so they, and then they have to they have to jump in the rocket yeah. to not be burned up by that's the, it yeah because I don't know if you've ever seen a rocket launch, but what they do is they leave the hatch to the rocket open until, until the very until last, the very last minute, minute, and then slowly shut it. Yeah, because <laughs> that's just, that's you know it's just how yeah. it's done. Especially when there's no one going in it. Yeah, that's yeah. when you because there's no first. pilots. That's yeah, <laughs> that's when you because <laughs> it's a test run with no one in it. Yeah, but yeah, they do that, and then it all seems like well, what can we do? So then yeah. they summon Captain Planet. Don't they? Yeah, he comes along and uh, tries to stop the yeah he's like whoa guys whoa toasty <laughs> his revisit of the 80s link character <laughs> yeah <laughs> um for captain planet with his mullet but he just pulls he pulls it but then they separate the bottom don't they yeah so captain planet falls to earth and everyone returns part like he tries to return the power doesn't he to yeah. all of them so they can save themselves but he's like because, because two of them are too far away, away yeah he still only has two powers yeah and he's still about so he's like he's like washed out <laughs> he's got some faded he looks like he looks like warm cat <laughs> when you put your hand on him and he went all weak and pink <laughs> He's all, all warm, Captain. He's Blair. warm. He's yeah. he's out the letterbox. Global he's warm. He's in your hands. Yeah, like by the fire, Captain Planet. Yeah, um, basically. And he's he's he doesn't even like wash up of uh, like. He washes guess, up on like beach. Gaia's like, yeah. beach. Who's she's the she's Mother Earth essentially yeah. that is. Uh, gives them their powers. Yeah, and it's like Whoopi Goldberg as well. Which <laughs> is, is it? Yeah. I didn't know that. That's so weird. <laughs> <laughs> blew their budget yeah. on Whoopi Goldberg just like what what is going on um, so well, meanwhile they're in space and this is when Tim Curry yeah really, really. comes into play oh he? yeah and he's he's take, he, he's like 2001 a Space Odyssey he's yeah. Hal and he takes control of the spaceship and won't let them return to Earth yeah he's, yeah, he's just got he's fully take, functionality he's, take, he's taking them to is it Venus, Venus yeah so that they'll die <clears throat> in the atmosphere um, which is actually yeah. really doesn't work in his favor because no. it w turns out to be the perfect example of a greenhouse plant. yeah it's actually and like explains the greenhouse effect to, to the, the president. president yeah it's a pretty good analogy to be fair yeah They're just like well do you want to look like this and he's like yeah. never because <laughs> they were just kept saying like why wouldn't you believe us it's yeah. like well you're not telling him anything yeah why wouldn't you believe us <laughs> a bad word uh, yeah I'm Bush. Yeah, it's just not economically smart. It's yeah, just not good for a budget. Economically smart. 
But then, then it cuts back to Captain Planet. Yeah, he's like, "What can I do, Gaia? Yeah, I've got, I've, I'm, I'm, I can't yeah. give them their That's powers." That's it. Back. My hue has shifted. <laughs> my my saturation has slid all the way back and down to she's zero. She's like, "You still got the greatest power of all, courage." Uh -huh. And then he, instead of having a moment of like, "Oh wow," he just goes. Thanks! Yeah. And then leaves. <laughs> Without a breath. Just Thanks. jump straight into da, the da, 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 <laughs> uh, Away he goes. And uh, he returns to the site of the the rocket. Yeah. Saves the the kids that are still left there. For, I don't know what. They're, they've been trapped by the woman. Yeah, I think. Tied so. up or something. Yeah, something like that. Uh, oh, oh, there's a whole thing in there where they, she ties him up inside the factory and leaks carbon dioxide oh, into it. Yeah. So, yeah. Every, so they can't do anything because they're, they're asleep. All sleepy. They're like, no, <laughs> no. No, the game is... Captain Planet comes in mm. and then, this is what I don't get. Yeah. So he comes in, he can't do anything. So instead of, they keep using their powers, mm. but at this point they could just return the power to him. Yeah. So he could easily save the day. Yeah. But he ends up having to like do loads of stuff without yeah, like powers. makeshift. <laughs> and he's like, whoa, I didn't realize how hard my job was. Whoa, <laughs> whoa, whoa. Undo these handcuffs. <laughs> Toasty, whoa. whoa. <laughs> Excuse me, princess, uh, planeteers. <laughs> so, yeah, I didn't get that. I, I was really confused about the power stuff. Like, yeah, why are they don't know. like, oh, we can't reach some of them and then. It's basically uh, to, to leave them in space, I suppose. Yeah. They explain the greenhouse effect. Mm. The president's like, whoa. Yeah. We've got to change this. And then after ages of being under the rule of Tim Curry. Yeah. Uh, luckily, the guy with the monkey. Yeah, the monkey, the pulls, monkey pulls, pulls one plug out. <laughs> and then that's, that's it. right next to yeah. the computer. And uh, then that's it. Game then over. they're sorted. Yeah. See, now you couldn't have that plot line. No. Because it could just run on battery or something. Yeah. But back then, wires were everything. That's it. And it was game over for Tim Curry. <laughs> Tim Curry's gone. <laughs> and then back back on Earth, yeah. Captain Planet foils the plan. He gets everyone out yeah. and beats up. Well, he doesn't beat her up, but he, he stops the leak or something, doesn't he? Yeah, something goes on with the Don't woman. Know, yeah. And then Kwame like, lands the thing like Sully on the yeah. water. And like they all get out. Oh, I remember there's a bit. There's a bit where <laughs> when he when he goes in to get them out, he's mm. dealt with everything mm. off screen, and yeah. they're like, "Oh, thank you, Captain Planet." He's like, "Luckily, I found these handcuff keys," and that's just like covers every plot hole in, <laughs> yeah. in that area. He sets them free. I'm like we can't be bothered. We're too busy explaining the greenhouse effect. That's it. I don't want. I don't want to deal with this. Um, mm. Yeah, and then pretty much everything's tied up at that point. Yeah. And the episode's ended. And the president's like, oh, okay. Ambushed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and he's going to change everything from there on. Yeah, and, and welcome to 2018. Like, tell, me, tell me again about windmills. <laughs> <laughs> and, and then like... Well, he's like, well, two words, they work. <laughs> <laughs> and they're like... <laughs> <laughs> the end of that. And then they have a nice little bit afterwards yeah post show eco tips oh yeah there's a couple of them when they're saying like all oh, the stuff you can do grow your own, grow yeah. your own plants because they eat carbon dioxide yeah. they're the air conditioners of the world and then captain <laughs> like the the water girl chucks like way too much water into the thing and just drowns the the seedlings <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah yeah and then it's like the power is it's yours the what was the other one? So there was another one as well. That was just like what another catchphrase. Yeah, and no, there was another like top oh, tip or something. I, yeah, I don't, was just like, there was like gardening mm, and something about having your own garden. I don't know. I don't know. That was, that's that how was, forgettable yeah, it was. Yeah, I mean, just, it was I really like oh, yeah. it just felt like they crowbarred it in because yeah. they had to be like eco, 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 eco. Yeah, um, and then um, yeah, and then that was the end of the episode. To jam. To jam. So now we are going to go to our rating system. Yes. Uh, thumbs up means healthy living. Yeah. Thumbs down, greenhouse planet. <laughs> Shaky middle, but I'm burst. <laughs> I just don't know. 
so let us start, as always, with you, Mr. J. Mann. Uh, well, this was uh, it's an interesting one to go back to. It yes. was I didn't I didn't really realise, I guess, when I was younger, half of the stuff they were talking about. Yeah, uh, it, it really, was really was. Red, didn't it? <laughs> yeah, it was like watching a documentary that was animated with a guy yeah. who was a mullet in for, <laughs> for no particular reason. It was. Yeah. Um, it's there's a lot going on in, in in this show. Like you've got the the characters. I mean, they're obviously this was like intense diversity at the yeah. start of the nineties, but done to the point where it's offensive. Like <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> just like it's like I think I do think that probably at the time their heart was in the right place. Yeah. But it's one of those things where when you look back, yeah. it's like whoa. Yeah. Like oh boy yeah it's just i mean that happens all the time i suppose that's with modern yeah. views on old things but without that you don't get to where we are yeah I that's suppose, true so. yeah like it needed to be done yeah but, well, you just, know it could have probably been done better to yeah be slightly offensive now but at the yeah. time i don't think it yeah. was to be fair if we were at that mixer and we met all five of these <laughs> people like, then, right, yeah. <laughs> yeah fairly well, there's a few the things they just it's just like a few things you can get rid of yeah to just not be that offensive yeah, yeah get rid of his monkey yeah and his feather thing on his arm yeah um a don't lot go, of the accents don't, yeah don't push too hard yeah. on the accents <laughs> soften the accents yeah. and uh yeah it's that's pretty much it some of them some of them weren't that bad no. the unmemorable ones yeah it's probably just because it was okay yeah but, but yeah i, I so, mean yeah some are particularly bizarre that's yeah it's a, it's a bit weird um and it does obviously come across as intensely preachy because it's mega preachy i mean that is all the show is it's just like save the environment kids yeah here's 20 minutes of how to save the environment <laughs> here's three tips yeah. of how to save the environment i am saving the environment but you better save the environment when you look back on it yeah you don't remember that no like i don't remember any tips from captain Planet. no so, it's, so maybe they were delivered in the wrong way yeah like but then we would have been very young yeah we, so that's true us. yeah like, like it's, it, is one of my earliest memories mm. poking that thing out of the letterbox so i mean maybe there is by a whole the thing i mean the toy <laughs> <laughs> don't huh? get him mixed up there oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> ah. captain <laughs> <laughs> uh, well uh, anyway change the tone on. of uh, uh yeah so i think for me uh it's gonna be a shaky middle shaky middle, shaky middle because I do like what they were trying to do yeah. and I think you know I think there is there's definitely good in what they're yeah. doing I think if I'd have grown up a bit more aware of some of this stuff then you know maybe I'd have yeah. made, you know lived a little bit differently and stuff I like what they're trying to do they they try and you know like you say they made a path for the like diversity thing yeah. and you know they're tackling stuff with real people like trying to put the president in the situation yeah. and you know giving people nudges and what what have you but um it, you know it probably just was their delivery was just too cornball wasn't it like yeah. as soon as you see captain planet <laughs> it's just like okay i'm out now yeah you know? i mean like if this was that you know, design is so I know, painfully I, instantly dated it is i mean i don't i don't know i can't pick one thing about him that i think is worth keeping do you know what i mean like if you were going to redesign yeah, captain planet now you just start from scratch the cause, globe yeah that's it <laughs> keep the logo keep the logo that's it i mean it. even that's not great no it's not really so probably don't you don't need yeah. to keep that so it's yeah that he's just just yeah, get rid of that. Just, completely, just bin that off. Completely. <laughs> <laughs> the worst thing about it, I mean, also it's it, it's sort of it's weird. You know, when you're just like, who are the heroes in this? Yeah, is it Captain Planet? Is yeah, it, is it all is of us? It, it just always seems a bit like mm. convoluted. Like yeah. we're just like we've got this hero, but then we want it to be diverse, so we've got all these heroes. Yeah, and then they've got the power, but yeah. then they share their power to make him. And then he's got the power. And they're given their power by Mother Earth. And yeah. it's like, oh, where, where it's just like, where's, the end? where's all this coming from? Yeah. yeah. It's like there's, there's some sort of really complex, like, yeah. 24 I graphic mean, they do a good story. job of explaining mm. all that yeah, in the straight intro. off. Yeah. yeah. But uh, you do wonder, if, is Captain Planet the problem with the show? Yeah. Could be. Because don't think you really need him because it's a bit like an eco power ranger setting isn't it yeah it is yeah until he comes into it and yeah then, i don't know i don't know because i was obviously had a toy of him so hmm. obviously worked but <laughs> well, I, uh, yeah 
it's the same, same, the same stuff, really. It's, it, I do like the message, mm. and I do think uh, it does a. It's good that it had, that it was there and it yeah. was out there. I don't know how effective it was. <laughs> yeah. But again, we might have just been too young. Mm. Um, but then, I don't know. I don't feel like it. It was as received as they they had hoped. Yeah. I, it it sort of reminds me of it's like it's one of those things where it's trying to it's very preachy hmm. but trying to hide it in plain hmm. sight yeah whereas you know if you had something like do you remember um the magic school bus yeah which we'll probably end up covering at some point that was like all about teaching you yeah. knew you knew it was it that was, was education. the whole point yeah but it was really good hmm. and you sort of enjoyed it still yeah and it was like oh i didn't know that didn't i and hmm. sometimes you think like when it comes to stuff like that, do you need yeah. to necessarily have these ridiculous plots? I mean, I know yeah. there's one episode of Captain Planet that's got Hitler in it. Really? Like they go back in time. What? Can't remember think... what. Yeah, is it, I don't know what it's. I don't know if it's about nukes or something. Yeah. But there's a lot of uh, extreme. Yeah. Cartoon plots for a bit it. Heavy for kids. Though. Yeah, <laughs> I think that is probably too much to throw at them. Yeah. Because you don't really understand no but then it depends what age it's directed at mm. um i don't know it, it means well but uh, getting getting out of out of the rating yeah. you've got to put a rating um, on it yeah i think shaky middle is, shaky, a, is a fair yeah. bet because yeah. i I'd, I'd be grudge giving it a thumbs down because mm. i think they their like their hearts are in the right place yeah yeah it. and and, and again, I don't know realistically how many people were, there might be some people that are like, oh yeah, I recycled every day because of Captain Planet. Yeah. Well, the, equally there might not be. Um, but it is things like the fact that they did use people from all over the world. Yeah. And even though they're not great representations mm. looking back now, this, it's still yeah. good that they did that where in, in a place where you, you, you know, it's, mm. it's not it's not expected at that time is yeah. it really and it. uh any anyone it just means anyone from any background can enjoy it because they've, yeah. they've all got an example on screen of you know themselves basically yeah which is you know what everyone pushes towards now that's it and this was it is crazy like to think that this was like 1990 yeah it's, like, it's the cusp of the 90s yeah. it is like, and like the stuff that they're covering is and just it is, like it does feel like an 80s cartoon yeah it doesn't it does. feel like a 90s cartoon no, no, at no. all um, um his mullet is probably a large part of that yeah but <laughs> yeah <laughs> a huge part yeah that. yeah but the episode itself is mm. yeah it doesn't it never feels like a 90s even the intro is just all very 80s yeah yeah so two shaky middles. Two shaky middles. Mm. Uh, I think that's a fair. Yeah. That's a fair score for Captain Planet. Yeah. Um, okay, so let's uh, finish up with a segment, um, and uh, once again we shall be revisiting the reboot. My God, it's dead. We need a reboot. Reboot. Oh yes. So rebooting what do you think um captain planet should it get a reboot and when it get a reboot <laughs> <laughs> do you think it will do you think it will and do you think it should yeah um i think uh let's go should first. i think sh do you it think it should, should get a reboot because i I think these issues are, I mean, they're, they're more relevant now than they were 30 yeah, I mean, years ago. We're, we're like, at a point now where it, we're, it, we dangerously yeah. need to, to start doing yeah. something about this. I mean, like, if we'd have listened in 1990, yeah. we wouldn't be where we are now. Um, and, it, it, you know, it's a, it's a difficult thing like to tackle like the environment and stuff because it's so widespread, it's so but it's complex. One of those things, it's so serious at the moment. Yeah. Do you think captain planet is the right place to be like the right way to get yeah. in it in yeah probably not the world. There's, there's i mean there's there's a there's lots of ways i mean every every avenue should be exhausted yeah. and doing it so i think 
you know, maybe having a Captain Planet as well as some other stuff yeah, is probably I mean, yeah. not gonna not gonna hurt. I think teaching the you know the next generation, I mean, I the morals. If that, it's done in a modern teaching. way, yeah, in a, in a way, it, and like now, you know, I mean, it's always cartoons are done in their period and mm. whatever is effective for the time will yeah. be. I suppose now people can only know more about it just because yeah. time's gone on. If they did it the right way yeah. really you know if you I suppose if you put in a proper story with mm, it yeah. that got people engaged enough mm-hmm. taught them on, on the way it is going to stick with you isn't it yeah because it, it is possible that it yeah. that to do it don't throw like as much information in one episode <laughs> yeah. as they do that's it and ridiculous details but they, it can be done like, yeah because I mean in the same way that like you know, lots of kids are learning lots about like crystals and stuff because of Steven Universe in the way yeah. that like, you know, that's not necessarily it's that's what it shows on the cover. Like you will learn about this stuff, but yeah. it's just it's put in there in a way that they just sort of organically learn. Yeah. And that's that's the thing. That's what you want. Yeah. isn't it? Something where you're like, oh, you're getting yeah. some out of it as well yeah. as the entertainment. you want. That's it. Or if you want to go the magic school bus route and be like, this is a, an educational yeah. show. But it's fun as well. Then, like, why not? You yeah. know, sort of teach the teach the lessons as well and keep the show good. But I think, yeah, there's the, it definitely needs. I think if there's going back I mean, to square one. <laughs> yeah, it needs a re, it needs a rehaul. Oh, definitely. Uh, yeah. Before a reboot. But now is uh, if you're gonna make another Captain Planet, mm. I suppose now is the time. Yeah. Because as well, the you know, there's all sorts that it, you know seems to be dealing with them that are mm. actually really present now yeah um because even just like race equality yeah. and gender equality that's it are in it and yeah then you've also got obviously the environment yeah the environment it's just yeah, yeah they are the politics all, as well politics like, and it's like that's it. it's all it's yeah. super present isn't it yeah now? i mean yeah. if you yeah that, that that episode just like how it's it's pretty funny really like in that episode they're trying to convince the president about climate change yeah and it's like we've seen that with the current president it, it, like that's an actual thing that's happening well, you right think this now. E- i mean this episode was nearly 30 years yeah ago. and it's like that's that, insane into yeah that that's still a problem yeah like that's literally the it's same easy, i think i suppose for us especially hmm. it's easy to think that these cartoons weren't that long ago hmm. But relatively, that is quite a yeah, long time, 30 long years. Time. For points like this to yeah. still be exact, like yeah. that episode, you could play that to someone now. No, yeah. And still, like, we made oh, that yeah, like, yesterday. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, mm. you know. So it, it, it obviously needs, you know, it obviously. Tweaking. Uh, yeah, it needs tweaking. A modern tweaking. But the message needs to be, yeah. again, like we need to just put that back into stuff because yeah. we still haven't learnt 30 yeah, years. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, it's, uh, we're still learning from all those mistakes. So it's definitely a, a need, but I think. Do you think it will get made? I don't think, I don't think it could get made. No. Just because it's so, it like, even though it does it in a, you know, a, a youthful yeah, like representation like way. It, it does it points out things that people wouldn't be happy with yeah yeah and i don't know who'd fund it yeah that's true yeah yeah so i like, think it'd be it'd be difficult to to put it, it out it is, that's one of the weird things about watching it is you think like who's funding this yeah like it's actually insane that yeah. someone was was funding this at the time because it goes against business and money yeah and that's where the money comes from yeah. is all that so. literally yeah in the show it's yeah. just like oh yeah climate change and it's like you say it's obviously you know, the economy it's crap with the toys and stuff yeah but, but i don't know it's yeah. weird it's weird that it got made for, yeah. for as long as it did yeah because i mean if you like it, those people like the planeteers now would be seen as like renegades do you know what i mean they'd yeah. be shunted by certain yeah, movements yeah. now it's like they're you know if we're like completely like <laughs> yeah. look at these like revolutionaries or whatever like they're terrorists now yeah. like just put putting through this message to the kids or whatever yeah. like that's just so that's not back to I, mean, I, don't, I don't know is it would get remade yeah I it's I like i think yes it should yeah no it won't, it won't. yeah yeah and that's i think that's pretty sad that's yeah it sad is really that i mean you never know never say never that but we're not, yeah we're less less likely to uh learn about the truth than we are to I don't think things yeah. change much in yeah. that bracket 
It's upsetting, really. Tune Jam gets sad. <laughs> <laughs> this week. This week on Truth Jam. <laughs> <laughs> Captain Planet, will they ban it? <laughs> what am I? Well, I'm ambushed. Yeah. I'm actually intrigued, though, to go back and wonder, see how many, um, you know, like how many things they did tackle head on mm. and try and sort of get people to change their ways and yeah. just try and pre warn us, like before everyone was more consciously aware yeah. of it. Well, this is where I'm going to talk back to you guys at home. <laughs> uh, if you want to get in touch with us mm. at, on the. Uh, the three elements of the internet uh, <laughs> Facebook, Facebook Twitter Twitter and Instagram Instagram and uh, let us know did you uh, were you affected by Captain Planet yeah. uh, in your environmental s- studies as a, as a youth or did you just like watching Captain Planet save the day yeah let us know if, if, it, if it affected you in any way mm. and uh, you know if you've got any requests you want to give yeah we are slowly making our way through them uh, so please feel free to yeah. chuck any requests our way. Yeah, good, bad, ugly, whichever. If you want to, see, if you if you, there's something you really hate that you just want to, <laughs> us to watch, <laughs> we will happily do, do, it. No, do it. And you never know, we might like it. That's it. So if you enjoyed that, please feel free to give us a rate and review on whatever you listen to. It really helps us out. And um, we also have a Patreon, so you can give us a small, small fee to uh, get some little extra episodes or, you know, just to help us out. So that would be fantastic. But otherwise, thanks for listening anyway. Um, It's been fun as always, if not deeply saddening this week. (laughs) (laughs) And... uh, Join us again next week for some light hearting. <laughs> <laughs> and until then, stay jammy. Hey everyone, thank you for listening to Toon Jam. And if you want to continue to help us out, you can help us by jumping over to our Patreon page, which is patreon.com slash toonjampod. And if you can rate and review us everywhere you listen to your podcasts, so on iTunes or on the Android apps, that would be a massive help too. Thank you. And stay jammy.